We finished a walking tour of many of the highlights of your collection and are now seated in front, front of a painting that is special to you by Perez Alcala from Bolivia. Tell me about this masterpiece. Well, of all the, the artworks of the collection, most of them were tech months in deciding which artists to, to visit and to select and many of the, many hours, maybe years, uh, deciding on the, the particular ones. This one I walked on to in the Sao Paulo, uh, uh, Brazil uh, Biennale. Mm -hmm. It's an international art show of great rep repute. It was stuck away in the corner in the in the Bolivian exhibit, which was a small it's a little spot that the that the uh, Brazilians gave the Ecuadorians of uh, the uh, Bolivians and uh, I went immediately with the cocktail in my hand down to the cashier and they should she's not on doing the preview. I found a piece of paper, which was really, the, everything was so clean. I put sold and put it on the, stuck it into the canvas and made arrangements to be at the opening at eight o'clock the next morning for this one. I have never, this one, this artist, this is technique. Absolutely controlled technique. As a watercolorist, as an artist, it's just a historical bit. It's, the anatomy is perfect. It's, the hillside is the perspective. But in there is technique that you can't find in any, any of the others. He's just such a technician, it's unbelievable. And it took me uh, six months to get it out of Brazil, but it was, but it was, but it was well worth it. You've mentioned technique as being a guiding principle in selecting this particular painting. Is technique what attracted you to the other artists in your collection? I think probably that's the basis of it all. I actually was, I was a, a graphic artist, uh, beginning with the, the, my first attitude at, at Braniff. And uh, I think through the development of the years of, of media, of, of advertising, paper, newspaper, and media, and uh, tour folders, and et cetera, et cetera. It, the graphic design was more important mm -hmm. uh, for years, and I think it shows in most of, most of my collection. Well, Mr. McCann, it has been such a delight to interview you and a true honor to work with you and your collection. Thank you so much. As you can see, the McCann Collection of Contemporary South American Art is varied in style and region and powerful in aesthetics. The collection will appeal to those interested not merely in Latin American art, but more generally in contemporary art. Please visit us online at ha.com in order to view the entire collection. We look forward to seeing you at the auction on June the 3rd, and thank you so much, Mr. McCann. Thank you. It's been a pleasure.